There was a lot of rumors, and actually some of this stuff I'll probably address tomorrow. There, there's a ton of rumors around the league, but one that I needed to get to here was Brian Windhorse talking about LeBron recruited Steph Curry All-Star Weekend. Steph hasn't signed an extension, and LeBron's already put the wheels in motion. Now, before we all laugh it off, like I know every Warrior fan wants to, because, you know, <laughs> no, that would never happen, right? No, hell no. Hold on. Let me just propose this question to you. Because I agree, it, it, the chances of it are happening are slim to none. But never say never. But has what Brooklyn done make him consider this? Let's say KD gets back here healthy in the next couple weeks, and Brooklyn just crushes everyone. They roll through everyone this year to the championship. Does Steph look at that and say, man, we got to make Brooklyn West. Might as well do it down in L.A. Again, highly unlikely. Highly unlikely. I get it. But, you know, the perfect storm, let's say the Warriors miss the playoffs here. They make a big push for it, miss it. The front office fumbles the draft pick. James Wiseman is looking more like Willie Cauley-Stein than Joel Embiid. Shit. Warrior fans, don't be so secure. Don't be that naive. Would I bet my money on him leaving? No, hell no. But I don't think it's as ridiculous as people think. Other Warrior news. It leaked out that the Warriors turned down a Spencer Dinwiddie for Kelly Oubre deal. People were asking me how I felt about that. Look, in a vacuum, I like Dinwiddie as a player better than Oubre. I do. But he's injury prone, right? He came out of what he came out of Colorado, the broken foot. That's what made him slide. He was hurt in Detroit. He's had such a meteoric rise, and I'm rooting for him. I think we all are because he's a unique dude. And you know, he's like he's the type of dude, his story is the type you make a, a documentary out of. His shoe brand and all that stuff. But he's injury prone. Now he's coming off the ACL. And Kelly Oubre, for all his warts, is as durable as they come availability is not the best ability in basketball, but it's up there, right? It's not football, but you got to be available. That being said, though, I think you got to keep an eye on Kelly Oubre, right? Because ever since these trade rumors and the trade deadline, it looks like we're getting contract Kelly here the final 25 games. Have y'all noticed? Like, I don't think he's passed the ball since the trade deadline. So maybe, just maybe, the Warriors leaked that rumor out to try to make Ubre feel better, like, hey, no, 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 we want you, Kelly. We turn this down. I don't know. 